The next object in that lovely chest of drawers was a felt image of a diaphragm and lungs. Why? Because the body is key to confidence. It's my absolutely firm belief. So often when we present and we're nervous, we're in our heads, psyching ourselves out, worrying about it. If you can be in the body, feeling your feet, feeling your breath, your head goes quiet. That changes everything. And why, why does this matter? It's because it's apex predator stuff. Your nervous system is an animal. It can either be a nervous animal, fast, tense shoulders, breath in the chest, or it can be a relaxed animal, safe, comfortable, at ease. What makes you a good speaker? It's the latter. So how do we do that? Firstly, I want you to stand tall. Lengthen out your spine, open up your peripheral vision, see wide like you're standing on the top of a hill. And then I want you to do what I call fofbok, which stands for feet on floor, bum on chair. Feel your right foot in your shoe, your left foot in your shoe. Feel your right seat bone on the chair, left seat bone. Plug in, like plugging into sockets. And notice how when your body grounds, your head goes quiet, and suddenly your apex predator, not prey. We've got mindset, the guitar, really taking control of your visualization and your rehearsal. We've got muscle, the diaphragm, the lungs, the body, really making your system feel safe so you can be in control. And then finally, the last object is all about mastery. In my TEDx, what I pulled out of that chest of drawers was a jam jar full of air because air is the key to your mastery as a speaker. All voice is out-breath. All pause is in-breath. And the quality of your pause is the quality of what you say. So if I rush my breath, hi, I'm Caroline, and it's pulled into my upper chest, I sound nervous and I feel nervous. If my breath is slow and relaxed, hi, I'm Caroline, I'm taking my time, I feel centered and calm.